ただきますうーんうーん This one so far、mm. The best、mm. one out of all the pretzels that we had the、mm. last time Mmm Delicious Mmm Does it Mmm Mmm Very good、mm. Do you know how many times you said mmm? Hello everybody! Welcome back! This is Shinichi and Satoshi and welcome to another food haul. Today we are eating Thailand part 2. This is part 2.、Uh, we had such a great experience trying out the Thai food、um, in part 1. So if you haven't seen that, make sure to go check that out. We have to say thank you to my friend Bas、thank、for you sending us all t h i s wonderful, wonderful treats from Thailand.、Um, I promise we're gonna come visit you、uh, sometime very, very soon. Anyway, let's get started. So, the first thing we have is pretz. Oh, actually, what's the taste? actually, he sent us three boxes of pretz.、Oh. You know, so which means he sent us a total of six boxes of different flavors of pretz. And today we're going to try the next three. The、is、first flavor? Green curry?、Mm, no, it's pacha a... seafood. Pacha seafood. And I didn't know that it was called pacha seafood, but I have had this before. I think it's a stir fry thing and it's usually very, very spicy.、Um, and they are very thin again.、Ah, again. So、yes. it's very good for beer. <laughs> so I prepared beer. Right, just as you promised. Yes. We got some beer. And if you guys haven't guessed, we actually filmed part one just before this one, which is why I'm wearing the same t shirt. I have to, I have to tell you, we're wearing the same clothes, you see. Oh, from part one. Oops. Thank you, Bob. Mmm. Mmm. Thai herb. This is delicious. Mmm. Wow.、Oh. Very good. This is the best one、mm. so far. The best、mm. one out of all the pretz that we had the、mm. last time. Wow, this tastes like a seafood stir fry. Does it match your beer? Mmm. Mmm, very good.、Mm. Do you know how many times you said mmm? <laughs> okay. And this is the l o t flavor. And this one is the original thickness.、Oh, okay. Do you know l o t This is like a, it's a salad. Maybe I ate in Thailand. Yeah. Mmm, mmm, mmm. Mm. Mm. This tastes like the salad. Mmm. Mm. This is the spicy shrimp flavor. And once again, these are the really, really thin ones. So let me give you two. The thin ones I noticed go better with beer because there's less bread, there's more seasoning. Mmm. Mmm. Oh. Mmm. Good. Mmm. 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 This has a little sour、mm. taste too, a little sour, savory, a bit spicy, a little sweet.、Mm. Like Thai food. Mmm. The next one is. I can't read. <laughs> right. And that's a picture of my friend Boss again. <laughs> yeah. Hello,、oh, Boss. Kokai. Kokai. I think that's the, the brand. Kokai. Oh, here it says something on the bottom. Peanuts nori wasabi flavor coated. Ah, so this is nori, nori wasabi, wasabi flavor coated. Ah, okay, okay. Gimme, 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 gimme. Oh, zoom. <laughs> How? <laughs> <laughs> oh. oh my god, that was shocking. I didn't expect such an intense or sudden、mm. flavor from、mm. peanuts. Oh. Oh. <laughs> this is really good. Very、Actually. strong wasabi. Very strong wasabi.、Flavor. I've never,、oh. I've never eaten such a strong taste. Actually, strong wasabi taste. Actually, if you、Snacky. get it on your mouth, it starts to tingle.、Mm. So, this is taro again. So, taro,、oh, taro fish snack barbecued flavor. It's very good for me too. <laughs>、mm. There's a picture of a fish. So, I'm thinking it's fish. Yeah, because it's fish snack, but it's a barbecue flavor fish snack. Oh, oh, barbecue flavor fish snack. Yeah, I'm trying to figure out what that would taste like. Thank you, boss. Thank you, boss. Hmm. It tasted just like the Japanese one.、Mm. Yeah? Mm. And it's very cheap. It's 10 baht. So it's like 30 yen. <coughs>、mm. Very, very cheap. It tastes just like the Japanese one. Because、mm. Japanese one is very, very subtle. It just tastes like fish. So this one actually is very similar to that. It's not bad at all, though. 
The next one is this maybe tablet. Maybe tablet. tablet. Well, we, we know it's tablet. We yes. did it before. It smells like milk. Mm. <clears throat> Are you burping? <laughs> Sorry. Is this chocolate? Like cocoa? Milk cocoa? A little bit cocoa? Maybe cocoa. Mm. No. Tastes like hot chocolate. I like these. I like these um, tablet candies that come in these pharmaceutical looking bags. I really like these. If I didn't know, right, and if I didn't see the inside, I would think this is some kind of herbal medicine. Some kind of medicine. It looks like there should be medicine in here. There's like all these numbers in the front. What does the numbers mean? But the package design is Buddha. True. But what does the number mean? 101068361010. Telephone number. That long. <laughs> Next one I have here are dehydrated mangoes. The last wow. time. It's, it's the mm. same um, series. You know, the last time we had the dehydrated strawberry and the dehydrated cherry tomatoes. You like the strawberry, I like the tomatoes. Today's one is mango, and you know, we both love mango. Mango lovers. Mango lovers. <laughs> and that's a big mango for Ooh. you. Does it just half it? We love dried mango. We do, we really do. Actually, I love the fresh mango. Mm. Fresh mango is it? <laughs> um, mm. Better. This is very good though. Mm. Not dry at all. Mm. It still retains the juiciness of the mm. real fruit. Mm. Which is what I love about this, um, mm. this series. Mm. The strawberry mm. was the same, it was very juicy. Even though it was dehydrated, it's not completely dry. In my mind, when, when I hear dehydrated, I expect it to be very, very dry. But I guess not. And the next one is mango and dehydrated melon. Oh, maybe cantaloupe. cantaloupe. It's dehydrated cantaloupe. cantaloupe. I see. And this mango is tasty blended mango. What the? <laughs> tasty blended mango. <laughs> well, the inside, it looks kind of different. There are two colors, like a darker color mm -hmm. and a lighter color. So I'm wondering if that's because they are different. Not only one, one, one kind different of... Different types? I don't know, and it smells different. It doesn't smell really? like the mango we just had. Mmm. 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 Mm. I mean, it's mango, obviously. But it doesn't taste like mango. The, the lighter color tastes more like mango. The dark one reminds me of sweet potatoes. Such an interesting texture, flavor, and taste. Unlike normal dehydrated mangoes. The other one is uh, cantaloupe, mm -hmm. dried cantaloupe. All right, I'm mm. so interested in, can I have another one? Because I'm so interested in this. Because the mango one kind of um, shocked me. It didn't taste like mango. Mm. Mm. This is um, cantaloupe. Mm. Cantaloupe. Mm. It has mm. such a nice texture. Mm. 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 Uh, not so chewy, um, a little bit sakuto. Yes, the sakuto <laughs> taste. It's like you know eating into a melon that that mm. <laughs> so I can't, mm. can't I don't know what how you describe it in English, but yeah. Mm. I actually like the cantaloupe more than the mango. Mm. And I usually like mango more. Mm. Yeah, this cantaloupe is better. Mm. It's really good, the mm. texture is really nice. Mm. Mm. Very interesting. Mm. The next one is banana chips. Hong Kong banana. Hong banana chips. It must be some kind of Thai banana. From natural. Ooh. I know Thailand, they, they, they grow a lot of bananas. Because mm. you know, when we used to drive along the countryside, so many banana trees. Ooh. I really miss Thailand. Really banana. Oh, and flavored? Is it flavored? Just banana. Whoa, oh, it's flavored. No, no, it's not. It's just banana. Like smell is a little bit spicy. No, Spice. no, this is no? Thai banana. This is Thai banana. Mmm, oh. mmm, 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 mm. 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 very good. 
So when I'm in Thailand, mm. the bananas always taste like this. Right, right, right. right? They're very mm. rich tasting. Mm. Net, they're rich. So uh, the smaller type? I think so. I think smaller. maybe. I, I, I don't know. The picture looks like a regular banana. But it tastes quite different from regular banana that we're used to eating. Mm. These are actually uh, deep fried. Ooh. Yes, that's why there's uh, palm oil. And it says vacuum frying process. A vacuum frying process. Not only. Can't imagine what that is, but it must be something very technically advanced. Really? Like instant ramen? <laughs> hmm. Okay. Alright, we have one more today. And I think it's uh, some kind of milk tea. It says no sugar added. Um, it's from Preau. That's the brand name. And they, it comes in these packets. And on the back it says they are 70 calories each. And so I'm gonna make a... Uh, uh, I'm gonna make one package because okay. I know you're drinking beer, mm -hmm. so we can just taste it. I'll be right back. Okay, we're trying to figure out if we're we're supposed to add hot water to it or milk. I have no idea. Maybe I'll just add hot water, or you know what? I'm just gonna mix a little bit of hot water, and yeah, I'll just say I'll be right back. So. Mm -hmm. All right, I think I was correct. I basically uh, mix it in with hot water. Mm -hmm. Is it powder? Ice in it, yes, it needs its powder. And it smells just like the Thai milk tea. Mm. Or they just call it Thai tea. It always See. has a, a condensed milk in it, usually in Thailand. It's very, very sweet. But this one says it has no sugar. So I wonder if this is unsweetened. Oh, this is actually sweet. Mm. So there must be like artificial sweeteners in here. It's very good. You see this Ooh. taste? Mm. This is the taste mm. of Thai tea. Mm. Mm, 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 mm. Right. What makes it mm. taste like Thai tea? I have no idea. These different tea leaves? Maybe it's different tea leaves. Not between China, Chinese tea and uh, English, English tea. tea. Yeah, something like that. Yeah, it's delicious. Ooh, I am so looking forward to drinking the rest of it because there are one, two, there are three more packets. <laughs> Yay! Wait, that I will drink all. Oh, come on. You're not really a fan of milk tea. I like tea. You do, but you don't like milk tea. He always says he doesn't understand why people drink milk tea. Because I always drink milk tea. And I said, there's no. I yes. I yes, always do. say, I always say, I don't understand the coffee with milk. And milk tea, you remember? No. Oh, come on, you <laughs> no. don't lie. Every time, because I don't drink, I don't drink coffee with milk. I drink tea only. And everyone knows that I don't drink coffee. Yes, so you, you always tell me, I don't understand why you put milk in tea. A lot of people do that, don't they? Okay, no comments. What is your favorite today? My favorite, my favorite today, okay, this one is so easy for me because I love it so much. It's a Thai tea. Mm -hmm. I love, I totally understand. I love I totally milk understand. tea. I love it. Mm -hmm. I wish we had this in Japan. I love it so much. Mm -hmm. My favorite is wasabi. The wasabi. <laughs> Very intense taste. The scary one. But this Tastes very really good and it's very very intense. Yes, it is. Mm. I totally agree. I totally agree. Suitable for vegetarians. That's what it says. Mm. But if I had to choose between the food, I would choose the first one that we had, the uh, that's all. The press, the the pad, the pad cha seafood. Ah, this is good too. This was yeah, amazing. Very good too. Yeah, I could surprise. Live on this. Mm. This is so this good. This is mine. <sighs> no 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 no. no. No, 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 yeah, give it to me. So, I hope you guys enjoyed today's food haul. Let us know what you thought in the comments down below. And as always, let us know which one was your favorite. We would like to know as well. Finally, thank you so much, Vas, for sending us all these wonderful food. And thank you, Vas. I mean, it's, it was such a good selection. 
uh, for us to try, especially for you because it was so much savory food that went so well with beer. Now we also did part one of this Thai food haul. If you missed that one, make sure you go check that one out right up there. And we did a whole bunch of other food hauls, so we also uh, left a playlist. Uh, thanks so much for watching, and if you haven't already done so, subscribe to our channel for more videos like this. See you guys very soon, and uh, Auf Wiedersehen. I keep saying Auf Wiedersehen because we did so many German food hauls. Not Auf Wiedersehen, but Koppunka. Koppunka. I wish we knew how to say goodbye, but I do not, so we'll just say Sayonara. Sayonara.